Not a codfish we hadn't gone so well. The berries not so plentiful in the fall. So when December came to raise an arm, not much Christmas spirit at all. And then Keynes was known down raise an arm for the treat she always baked. But when the holidays came to her house, it was almost more than she could take. You see, Nan was getting on in years, and it was tough to bake it all from scratch. So instead of baking cakes for days, she planned just one big batch. She called Rosalie up in Kellegrews, so her daughter would get the stuff and send it out on Saturday on the Raisin Arm taxi bus. So when all the packages, bundles, bottles, and bags showed up like she said, well, when Nan Kane stored it all away, it, it took up seven sheds. Now, to make this one batch mighty cake, she'd need some awful pan. So she called up Preston down the arm. She knew he'd lend a hand. He brought up his 20-foot aluminum boat, <laughs> put it in that old woodshed in hands, uh, took out the seats, and you know, Nan was pleased. She said, uh, boys, a, a lovely uh, punch-shaped pan. So she lined it with buttered paper, put in candied fruit and more, spices, molasses, and no, a bunch of rum, <laughs> and, and mixed it all with a skull and all. Sure, she had better to the gunnels, <laughs> enough to feed a town. I allow as if it was on the scale, it'd dress 500 pounds. But now she didn't have a giant oven, which is what this job required. So she just closed the door to that old wood shed, and then she set the shed on fire. <laughs> well, the Raisin Arm Volunteer Fire Brigade, they were quickly on the scene. But when they saw what Nan was up to, well, they did not intervene. Uh, they pulled up chairs and boiled the kettle as a, a light snow began to fall. And cease, the fire marshal said, boys, this, this is the best Christmas fire of all. And then Harry took out his accordion, and they all sang carols so well. Uh, Harry always plays on the way to fires, because, well, the, the fire truck got no bell. <laughs> And then neighbors started showing up. The, the whole community came round, shook hands, and wished each other well as uh, that shed burned to the ground. Some brought purity syrup and others red rose tea. And now there's, there's lots of Christmas spirit round that fire by the sea. Well, when the flames died down and that cake was cooked, Nan peeled back the paper. And then the whole town smelled like Christmas. She was that good of a baker. They all sang carols as Harry played. Uh, youngsters danced in woolen sweaters. And then shared around that warm Christmas cake, boys. Uh, you couldn't get much better. Yes, raise an arm down in Bonavis Bay had its Christmas spirits lifted higher with a giant boat-shaped uh, rum fruit cake. <laughs> and a woman starting fires. Happy holidays. Wash your hands.